gathering strength amidst constant encouragement and striving forward under each set goal. We look back at 2023. We continue to create good products and services, while being deeply involved in the Ganoderma industry and promoting public health. 2023 was a year full of challenges, and also the 34th year of Ganoherb's focus on Ganoderma and continuous innovation. This year, we continuously innovated in the field of Ganoderma breeding research, not only adding 12 new Ganoderma strains, but also successfully carrying out the first sterile separation, germination and mononuclear mycelium culture of Ganoderma spores. The new variety, Ganoherb S3, also successfully passed provincial recognition. Following the establishment of the Ganoherb Academician Workstation, we added the Wu Minghong Academician Studio, actively exploring the R&D application of traditional Ganoderma in new fields. The Ganoherb Technology R&D Center located in Puching also officially started construction this year, aiming to create a fungal science popularization, research and demonstration base that integrates scientific, knowledgeable, interesting and interactive features. In addition, the National Key R&D Plan Modernization Research of Traditional Chinese Medicine. Ganoderma special research topic that we have undertaken has also successfully passed the acceptance and become a new model for standardized planting of Fujin traditional Chinese medicine. Relying on three national-level scientific research innovation platforms and academician resources, Ganoherb not only added a number of invention patents in 2023, but also actively accelerated the transformation of technological achievements and carried out user-oriented product operations. Ganoderma granules, the second-generation Ganoderma spore oil and other series of new products came out in time, committed to bringing a better quality and more efficient health experience to global users. Meanwhile, Ganoherb continues to accelerate the pace of going out, actively participating in large-scale exhibitions at home and abroad, joining hands with Lang Ping, the former head coach of the Chinese women's volleyball team. In the origin of Chinese organic Ganoderma, the picturesque Puching, with the medicinal, edible, nourishing, and enjoyable Ganoderma culture as the link, holding the Ganoderma Culture Festival, attracting experts and customers at home and abroad to explore the base, trace the source, talk about quality, learn the Chinese Ganoderma stories, and reaching more users. In order to maintain the high quality of the product throughout the entire chain, Ganoherb has not only passed the organic certification of China, the US, Japan, and the EU for 18 consecutive years, but has also increased the detection of pesticide residues in each batch of raw materials from over 500 items to 604 items. In August of this year, the detection capability of Ganoherb recognized by CNAS also increased from 248 items last year to 279 items. Quality improvement, standard first. This year, the four standards including technical specifications for the harvesting and processing of Ganoderma spore powder and technical procedures for the breeding of Ganoderma strains, which Ganoherb took the lead in formulating, were officially released. Ganoherb has participated in the formulation of 27 standards in total, continuously leading the industry development. To further realize the corporate philosophy of health for all people, Ganoherb continues to strengthen brand building and deepen the practice of social responsibility. For three consecutive years, it has sponsored the International Women's High Tea as a gift from the East and protected women's health. At the same time, the fourth Tumor Prevention Week public welfare event was launched, and for the first time, a Turing Science Popularization Lecture was held in Beijing, Nanjing, Chengdu, and Guangzhou to promote scientific cancer prevention and public health. This year, with sufficient technical precipitation and quality innovation, Ganoherb has created brand power, improved product power, and strongly entered the fourth batch of industry-leading teams in Fujian province. The first-term brand value top 100 in Fujian, in the front page of Reference News, a prominent Chinese newspaper, and made its first appearance in Times Square, New York, resonating with the world and the Times. At the same time, after the most outstanding SciTech commissioner, the founder Li Yi once again won the May 1st Labor Medal of Nanping City and Fujian Province Labor Model, using Ganoderma as a medium to strive to be a struggler in the new era. Every breakthrough is precious, every effort is moving towards the future. 2024, we set off again.